Hey guys, welcome to our video where we will be discussing how an electric fan works. Have you ever wondered what makes your fan spin and create a cool breeze during hot summers? Well, the answer lies in the concept of electromagnetism. The electric fan has two major components, the motor and the blades. The motor is responsible for converting electrical energy into mechanical energy, which makes the blades spin and creates the airflow. Now let's take a closer look at the motor. The motor consists of two main parts, the stator and the rotor. The stator is a stationary part of the motor that contains the electromagnets, while the rotor is the rotating part that consists of the fan blades. When we switch on the fan, an electric current flows through the stator windings, creating a magnetic field. This magnetic field then interacts with the rotor, causing it to spin. The fan speed can be controlled by changing the voltage of the electric current that flows through the stator. A higher voltage will result in a faster spinning rotor, while a lower voltage will result in a slower spinning rotor. Finally, the blades are designed in a way that they push air forward as they spin, creating a cooling effect. The air is pulled in through the back of the fan and pushed out through the front, creating a constant flow of air. So, that's how an electric fan works. Next time you switch on your fan, you'll know exactly what's happening inside. Thanks for watching.